was the craziest. I wish that was the craziest hunt ever. Sitting right next to Mackenzie in the tree stand. Like four four rank hogs come in. Got drop drop this one. That's gonna be a good one to eat. And then when I shot when I shot that one, I hit the big mama. The big mama was doing circles. It came right underneath us. I shot it with this and then we ran there. I chased him. Did you see me go by? Mm -hmm. I was chasing it through the brush and then I thought that's how you know. That's how you know I finally got a good shot. <laughs> and I, it was still running and I grabbed it by the back hoof and it was trying to, trying to drag me and boom. That was blood all over the gun. That was crazy. The big one's down over there. Got a little 40 pounder. Plenty of food on the table for the fam. Good job, babe. <sighs> Doubled up. Some rank hogs in the spot. <laughs> yeah, nice. A little 50 pound Fisher Forest hog. But don't go anywhere. We got another one. <laughs> we got Big Mama. Big Mama Fisher Forest hog. Alright, we're out here on the, the Fisher Customs property, the Fisher Forest, and we got up in the tree stand at like 6 o'clock in the morning, like first light, and it didn't take long for these two hogs to come in, come in the spread. Um, our tree stands were right next to each other, like we were leaning up on each other in our tree stands, and um, I took, they came in, this one was pissed, it kept, it like saw us in the tree stands, but um, all the, the smaller ones were munching on corn, so um, I put a shot on this one, but they were so close together that it hit this one also. Um, that one dropped in place, but this one started running around. It came right back to the tree stand. I got a shot on it with my pistol, um, but it kept running. So I hopped out of the tree stand and I chased it like a big loop around the property. And I put, I fired all my, my five shots of my 45 long coal and 410 out of the judge. And, um, <laughs> yeah. I was chasing this thing. I actually grabbed it. It was I was right behind it going through the forest and I grabbed it by the tail and um, it wiggled out from my grasp and kept going and I was right behind it. I finally caught up to it, grabbed it again, and finally put another shot on it. And um, that crazy hunt doubled up in Mackenzie. Fisher Forest putting food on the table for the fam. Super blessed by Mother Nature. Thanks for watching Fisher Customs. <laughs> All right, today we're doing a wild hog, wild hog barbecue. Straight, straight from the Fisher Forest. We have some nice seasoned ribs. Oh, this one got a little shot with buckshot, but we're slapping it on the grill. They were walking in the woods a couple days ago, and now we are grilling them up, making some nice smoked ribs, putting food on the table for the fam. It's looking good, and we're ready to flip. All right, the ribs are looking good. We're gonna pull them off and add a little homegrown pineapple to the grill. Homegrown, <laughs> homegrown pineapple. Good job, babe. <laughs>